What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the show. As always, I'm Sebastian Volkov, and this is Bloodwash, and I hope like fuck some some of our progress saved from last time. Uh, Plaza. I, 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 oh, did I go to chapter? I don't know. Who the fuck knows? Oh, we started over from there where we started. It's fine. It's totally fine. If you missed out on anything, you missed out on the prologue, and you can go watch that in the other video. So, which, uh, where we finished Murder House. Wee wee! Do do laundromat! Your mom! Uh, like I said, if you missed something, ah, uh, cock. If if uh, anything that I skip over is shit that we saw in the last thing, so I'm just kind of playing catch up right now. Cause uh, I don't think it saved. <laughs> Whoa, forgot how insanely high the. You know, it's fine. Camera sensitivity. Let's turn that down about a mile. Mm -hmm. At least a little bit. Now we'll try it. Yeah, it's not as not remotely as abrasive. Ooh, remote. Gib. I have remote. Let's see. I need change for that. Yo yo what's a cracking mosquito? Okay. So you got the change like we did last time. <laughs> Fucking playing catch up. Throw our laundry into the wash from a mile away. That was very loud for some reason. Now we have to go around recollecting all these fucking magazines. Even though I didn't even find, uh... Soul Eater number two. Last time. The women's room is locked. The men's room is locked. Nobody's allowed to take a shit off piss here. Whew. Dryer sheets. Thought that said like. Thought that said something about oysters. I don't remember this happening last time. Okay, big breach. Okay, now that we're letting the laundry wash. What in the world is that noise? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've seen all this before. We read this one. Sin Eater number one. Good times. I actually really like that. So let's go in here and... Wait, we have a remote. The remote work on one of these TVs. Now that's a nice TV! Maybe. Maybe it will. Maybe it won't. Is my stuff working? Oh, of course it's not. I don't have the fucking desktop audio on because I'm a fucking moron. Absolute magic moron. Let's see, Reapers number two. I don't have Reapers number one. <laughs> Leave it to me. Start everything off right. At least I figured it out in the first few minutes. Greasy manager, we talked to him. We well, don't want to talk to him about this. What about this? What about these urban legends? What about this senator? Shit, I forgot there was that poster on the wall in the laundromat. That it's like, oh, I should go take this around to everybody. Oh, say about this missing kid. Ooh. <laughs> Just like a nosy person. Ha! An ugly doll head. I don't remember seeing that on my way in. 
<laughs> now you do. Uh, fucked up wall. Where was that? Missing child poster. Oh, I think it was in the pizza. Pizzeria bathroom, actually. Ah! Itchy leg. Income tax. The real horror story. Yay, hey, welcome to Pizza Pizza or whatever this place is called. Gib. Uh, fine. Also booze! Mega poops! Ah! Yes! Death! Destruction diarrhea! Not the South Korea! I think you made that same joke last time. say I am doing a fuck ton better than a dad like a fucking douchebag pizza box I have to keep this place in that man next time I order a pizza you don't even know where this was can I, no. can I get you something no. like no, you know well, a pizza free. I didn't mean to talk to you twice bro <laughs> okay it's fine I was just dog him that's not creepy at all oh good I didn't think so either do you know anything about the recent disappearances? <laughs> yeah, no, your mom. Not really. One of the girls who was in my class was one of them, though. I didn't know her too well, except that she was pregnant. I hope that she just skipped down and not one of the, you know, victims. <laughs> yeah, man, like, totally. <laughs> well, that was a good talk. Okay, okay go love you, bye. Wait a minute. City to number three. Still need number two. Uh, number two. Excuse me, sir. Crazy, right? Thinking about all the killings can creep a guy out. Especially being all alone out here. Yeah, I know the victims are all women, but still. Okay. Some... Uh, great commentary you had, Chief. Do, do, do. Maybe I just need to ask the laundromat guy. Uh, oh my god. Let's go be nosy with the newspaper now. Since we're already over here. Wish this place would go up in flames next. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, pizza man. You're not helpful. Look, I don't know anything about that. I just opened up shop not long ago. As I'm sure you can tell by how clean it is in here. However, I'm no detective. But if you ask me, I think it has something to do with the sounds I hear at night outside. I don't want you to think I'm losing my marbles, but I hear some weird things out there some nights. Just screams, I guess. Almost like from a child. But I can tell that ain't no kid out there. That's good. <laughs> Probably women then. Yeah, I guess I can put this newspaper away. Zoom! I didn't realize I could do that. We 
he's gone. Oh, looks like there's zero minutes and six seconds left. Perfect. <laughs> Got him. Don't need to, dry, to uh, dry these or anything, you know. Just, uh, do I? Mm -hmm. Ah, yes. Drying machine. Flop. Ding. Did someone ring the bell at the front counter? No. No, nobody did. Oh, look, a key. It's a pooper key. Ding. Ding, 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 ding. <coughs> I don't know why. I'm a douche. <laughs> Wait, what's on this side? Is there anything I can do with this handheld, actually? Oh! Poxy's Revenge! Press X to start. Let the man nap. Nap until you're dead. Oh, those... Are those bad things? I think these are bad things. Oh! I understand now. Avoid the triangles. Kill the children. Good. I didn't know that was a knife in my hand. That. Maybe it moved, and I was just too excited. Hey! Hey! What? What? Blitz! score 15 oh that wasn't that bad then no go away steam we're not talking to you you filthy skank and to the pooper we go why would i go to the women to the i can go to the men's locked weird oh i better need to not be fucking brain dead and whip out the key huh ah men's bathroom perfect just where every lady likes to go pee. What? Condom dispenser? Hmm. 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 Little too late for that. <laughs> it's locked. I wanted to see if they were like super tall. But apparently not. It's fine. Janitor. Explore the bathrooms. God damn it, Steam. I'm. You can't see it, but Steam's stupid menu keeps pulling up. I don't know why. I'm not even using Steam. 
That's a poor bird. Eight, six, seven, five, three, oh, nine, eight. Uh, uh, uh. Reop. Oh, that's Reapers. I thought that said Reopers. Like Reopers number two. Uh, go poop. No, go poop. Go poop. This might be fun to call if I get bored. There's a phone in the lobby I can use. Jump. Threaten me with a good time. Who could have put this here? Hey, hey. <laughs> How about a little head? Oh. I wanted to flop the head on it. It's fine. What am I going to do with the other 55 seconds? Oh, cool. No one's called me that before. Er, I mean, hey there, stud X. <coughs> I'm so glad you called. It's been so lonely over here. Been thinking about your big cup. Damn it, I'm sorry. This is my first night on the job. <coughs> I don't think it's for me. Well, that's okay. I didn't even know what this number was for. I just. I like the sound of <laughs> Rats. Oh, it's been one night, but I've had my fair share of creeps. Have you? <laughs> You've not met me yet. I'm more than your fair share. Oh, I bet. Well, what kind of person just dials a random phone number at this time of night? A me? Out college student who's waiting for their laundry to finish so she can go home and get some sleep. That was a lot more words. Those <laughs> places are still open at this time of night? Uh, just this one, a little out of town. Wait, in that plaza with the pizza palace? Ah. I had a hoodie under my ass. Yeah, that one. You know it? <laughs> How very weird that we're from in the same town. Yeah, I live out there. Hey, you really shouldn't be out over there this late at night. Not with the womb ripper at large. I know one of the girls who went missing. She disappeared around that area, and I'm telling you that you should really just go home. There's some things that the newspapers don't talk about. There's more to it than just the stalking and killing. It's a real psychopath, and you are right in the middle of its hunting ground. Do you understand? It. You need to take your laundry right now and get out of there as fast as you can. Your 360 seconds has ended. If you have another late night sexy conversation, please enter your credit card number now. Where's my wallet? Thought it I really wish I could leave. I just uh, got to wait for my laundry. Oh, looks like there's six minutes and 36 seconds left. Oddly specific. Hello. I have a friend. The hell was that? I don't know if it was in the game or what. Hey. Doing a late night wash. Oh my God. One? That sounds girl, but what? Well, we talked to the shithead last time. Not interested. Um, I wonder if I can just read a comic in the meantime. Do we have that's Sin Eaters 3. I don't want to read Sin Eaters 3 or Reapers 3. I've got to read number one. Urban Legends number one. Go somewhere where the machine isn't loud as fuck. Jojo King, Maximel, Steve Benton. Uh, I wonder how long this one is. So, so I says to him, Hey, if you run to the ER fast enough, they might just be able to sew it back on for you. <laughs> you penis. <laughs> Of course, the dog ate it right up off the floor before the pool. Full. God damn, these are some weird words to me. Before the poor fool could pick it up. You don't say. I say. Then I gave him the knife. Didn't even have to say a word. And he carved the poor pup up to get his finger back. Yeah, I thought it was a dick. Jesus. Yeah, sure. <laughs> well, well, well. Look what we have here. 
just blow into town, did you? Jeepers. Been a while since we had fresh blood in this pit stain of a town. What's that, you say? Seemed like a nice place to settle down. Why well, don't you pour yourself a glass and I'll tell you a piece of history about this old town. Take your jacket off, boy. Don't tell me to jack it off. It's about to get real hot in here. We're not talking about your cousin, are we? Baby in the oven. Edgefield, De Sarka, 1983, Southern Suburbs. No, no, let go. Please, ma'am, just let them do their job. <laughs> Trust me, ma'am, you don't want to look. We already looked at who did this. Reports are still unofficial, but speaking to a shocked paramedic, it seems that the murder victim is an infant, James Brody. The murderer has yet to be confirmed and is believed to be at large. We await an official statement from the authorities very soon. Please God, no! But what we do know is this. This tragedy has been the fourth of its kind in as many days. The previous three murders have all been committed by the respective victim's babysitters in a most gruesome fashion. This one, as it appears, seems to be no different. No connections have been made besides the age of the victims. The culprits have all been different babysitters in the manner in which the children were... Mad James! Bam! Get your hands off him! He's not dead, idiot! <laughs> As is popularly reported, these poor souls have all been basted in... <laughs> placed in an oven to be roasted alive. You're okay, James. You're okay. All right, well, I gotta get going, babe. No, you absolutely cannot come over. I know it'll just be me and the baby, but still, sometimes the Dixons come home early. And the last thing I need to is, uh, is to explain why you're here. Yeah, yeah, I know, I'm no fun. See you tomorrow, Roy. <laughs> yeah, good night. All right, Mom, <laughs> I'm off to the Dixons. Need anything before I come back? Do you think maybe you can cancel tonight? Why, well, Mom? What's wrong? The news. They say another child has been killed. It's so horrible, Jenny. And I don't know what's going on, but come on, Mom. It's just the change of the times. Kids are doing drugs, and you can't trust anyone anymore. All the murders have been by crazy, whacked-out teens, and I'm not one of them. Don't worry, Mom. I have no desire to cook some babies tonight. Jenny! <laughs> That's a high-pitched voice of his murder. Jesus Christ. Detective? Jesus! Is that cop Jesus? <laughs> uh, sorry, Ray. Dropped my last cigarettes. Sorry, sir. Can I have a word with you? Sure, kid. You can have a word. Just might not get too many back. Have a monster of a headache. These crimes? I ain't never seen nothing like them. You've only been on the force, what? Five months? No, that's not what I meant. It's been a while, I should probably check on the letter. <laughs> I mean, in my whole life, I've never heard of anything like this. What? I don't know who's talking. Thanks, yeah, I know. Maybe it's a change of times. Maybe it's something worse. Wait. Oh, uh, I guess it is a cop. I fucking couldn't tell. It looked like pink fingernails. All we can do is advise couples to watch their own kids until this either dies down and goes away or, well, I don't know. So you're saying there's nothing we can do besides carting off these poor kids' parents and babysitters to the nut house after the fact? Seems so. As always, the number to the restaurant is on the fridge, along with some pizza money if you get hungry. And if you're not hungry, please take the money anyway. We really do appreciate... <laughs> we really do appreciate... doing this at the last moment for us. It's not a problem at all. A few more nights like this, and I'll have enough for that car I've had my eyes on. God damn, you must be getting paid a shit ton. All right.
might well take care of Artemi. We'll be back before midnight. Well, I guess I could do my homework. Nah. Doom, doom. Doom, doom. Doom, 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 doom. Later. Who's there? Oh my god, gotta check on Timmy. You have a bad feeling in your stomach, Jim. Something's not right. This whole town isn't right. Well, that's a relief. They're kind of cute when they're asleep, I guess. <laughs> it's just me, babe. <laughs> what the hell was that? Really? Hey, I'm sorry, honey. I didn't know the kid was asleep. Come on, let's go downstairs. <laughs> I'm sorry, babe. Let me get you a drink. Here you go, beautiful. Thanks. Why'd you even come over anyway? I mean, I'm... What? what? I mean, what I said, you're not getting any tonight. Gee, thanks. No, actually, that's not why I came over. I, I just wanted to see you. My parents are fighting again. Oh, oh no. I'm sorry, Roy. I didn't mean to be so harsh. You can stay as long as you want. I'd really like to. They're trying to drag me into it, but I just want to get away, you know? Uh, oh, yeah. Can't even sleep in that house anymore. Shh. It's okay, babe. It's okay. I love you. I love you too, Jen. <laughs> Thump. Huh? Bum bum, bum bum, bum bum, bum bum. I I I. What the fuck? Snake. Jenny, Jen, there's someone up here. Crash bang. Let go. I'm coming, Jen. Oh man, I forgot my pot downstairs. Meanwhile, in the bar, <laughs> don't get many of your kind in here, Ray. Don't want you scaring off my customers. Don't mean to be disrespectful, just I gotta make a living, you know. Just can't have this place get a reputation for housing boys in blue. Nothing against you or anything, Ray, just, just get me a fucking beer and I'll leave. Don't shoot me for it, jeez. Leave. No charge. Thanks. Weird. Could be murderers going on in each of those houses. But who's to know? Damn. I hate feeling helpless. Jen! My God! Back there, mine. I don't know what the fuck kind of voice I do for that thing. Let them go! It's almost complete. Soon he will be risen in my task complete. Oh, uh, whatever you're doing, I'll stop you. Ah, you can't, boy. It's too late. This child is the last one that is needed. Uh, Roy! <laughs> uh, bam, crash. I told you, leave us alone. You will die tonight. Girls, <sighs> well. uh, get off. Tastes like chicken. <laughs> the fuck is that? <laughs> Shotgun? Blam. Jesus. You did it, Jen. <laughs> Jen? Right. My hero. I'm very confused on what to do. Man, it's fun. Come give your princess a kiss. Come to me, lover boy. Jen, what's wrong? What happened? Stay back. What's wrong, babe? Don't think I'm pretty anymore. Stop. Gotcha. Whoa. Uh. <laughs> uh, uh. Jenny. Jen. Leave the kid alone. Flop, flop, flop. Let my Jenny go. Open up. I said open up. Freeze now. <laughs> I 
officer. Look, I really don't know how to explain it, but, well, you see... God damn it, it's another babysitter. It's another babysitter murderer, isn't it? Fuck, that was hard. Get back. Hey, but wait, it's my girlfriend, but it's not her fault. Police, listen to me. You're not going to believe me, but you can't hurt her. She's possessed by a spirit or something. Are you on something too, boy? Because if you are, you better shut up and let me do my damn job. What the fuck? <laughs> Hi. Hey there, cuties. <laughs> Good Lord in heaven, something is wrong with you, girl. <laughs> what? Oh. You wouldn't hurt a little old me now, would you, Ray? Back to hell with you, demon. No! <laughs> you idiot. We have to put an end to this. Get the baby. <laughs> Come on! Come on! Hey! <laughs> What the hell? I'm confused about what happened with the knife. Oh, look out! Ugh. Uh, I hate you and all you fucking cops. What do you do when my baby and I needed you? Oh, what did you do when my baby and I needed you? Why? Why? Why didn't you help me? Why didn't anyone help me? Yeah. Uh, it's coming. Bush. Well done, Suzanne. L let me, let me hold him, please. Suzanne, you know the agreement made by your parents. Just for a minute. You're not married, Suzanne. It'll be better taken care of with someone else. We promise. No, no, please. Suzanne, that's your name? I don't. I don't exactly know what happened to you, Suzanne, but I'm sorry. Truly, I am. I just want my baby. Baby back, baby back, baby back. Rips. But you killed so many innocents. Your rage is misplaced. You've made so many families feel your pain. How does that help? I think there's only one way you'll ever see your baby. <laughs> No, stop! I missed that part. Whoa! <laughs> Jenny! <sighs> Don't die on me. Be careful. It might still be her. <laughs> Roy, what happened? Oh my god, you're alive! <laughs> Ouch! <laughs> Baby swaddle. Uh... Boogie boo in the oven. Why is it that we always arrive after all the action? Oh my lord, you're safe. I think I need to. I think I find a need need to find a new job. I can agree with that. And so it is in this quiet neighborhood that we're being told that the babysitter murders have finally ended. Details are sketchy at best as to what was behind the rash of sayings, but we do understand that a single individual who has yet to be named was behind it. Stay tuned, folks. I have a feeling a lot more will come of this. Whoa, where is he? More. So, what do you think? Still a nice place. <laughs> Maybe if you attend a different, more satanic church on Sunday and instead of putting your kids to bed, you throw them in the oven. <laughs> That was the greatest story I've ever witnessed. That was pretty good. Yuck. Well, that's enough for tonight. If this story didn't scare you off, which if you made it this far, I reckon it didn't, then do come back some other night. Plenty more legends from these neck of the woods, yes siree. Ah. I'm here most nights entertaining the ones who have a penchant for the macabre, the vile, the strange and sadistic. <coughs> What's going on, Tracy? Give you a ride home? What do I look like? Someone with a death wish? Just stay under the street lamps. Don't go down Fifth Avenue after midnight, and whatever you do, if you hear something behind you, 
don't turn around. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> That's two of those comics we read. They're, they're fairly long. Especially for, like, single pieces of them. <clears throat> what the hell? These clothes are still wet. This machine must be broken. But those were my last quarters. I need to find that employee and get my quarters back. Dun, 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 dun. Is that wrong? Dun, 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 dun. Just gonna take my quarters back. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> I didn't even see. <laughs> I didn't even see those. It's it wiggling. I need to call the police. <laughs> the police? I don't know. Hammer. This might come in handy later. Safe. As if I would know the code. Maybe you do. Nine one one. What's your emergency? Hello. My name is Sarah. You need to send someone now. I'm at the. <laughs> Sorry. 911 sick of your shit, Sarah. Shit. <clears throat> Dispatch said they got a call coming from out here. But it's strange. I can't seem to be able to find anyone. Said Officer Tim Button. I don't know what his first name is. Locked. Weird. That's very loud. The uh, income tax office? Enter offices! Hello? Is anyone there? This is the police. If anyone is there, then come out now. There's something wrong here. Investigate thoroughly. You're screaming at a baby crying. Some notices, schedules, and a note from Donna that reads Whoever is eating my lunches, I will find who you are and report you to Henry. Poor Donna. Uh, thought I couldn't go back here for a second, it stopped me. Nothing of any particular interest. Do I have a gun? Not that I can use. Hmm? Ah. Uh, oh! Oh! Baby back ribs? Is this a Chili's? Man, I hope I went in the right door. Locked. Maybe I can find the key around here somewhere. Also locked. Figures. <laughs> so many locked doors. Huh? What the fuck was that? What the fuck is that shit? Holy Jesus. Was it holding a child? Maybe. Dun, dun. Uh, that's a big closet. It's all dark and spoopy. Okay, maybe there is a key in here. You know, just oh, there is. Look at that. I'm a dumbass. Got it. I'm king of the morons. Okay, so wait, do I have to fuck me? Seems like this key doesn't fit the door's lock. Bang bang. Fit that one. <laughs> oh, good, a maze of boxes, just what I always wanted. FM. It's old radio boxes. Uh, okay, I guess there's something in here to find. Perhaps, maybe. Maybe haps. 
is a little maze, so. Oh my god, am I glad to see you? Oh no! You gotta help me. Damn, I thought You're I could shoot him. Crazy person running around with a knife. <clears throat> Slow down. It's okay. Just follow me, and I'll get you out of here. Oh well. <laughs> Guess I couldn't keep that promise. Ah. Uh. Shit. There has to be another way out of here. Uh, very. <laughs> that was. Why do you shoot? The hell? <laughs> that works too. That's a big sharp pokey thing. Where'd you get those? Weevil weevil wobble. Serpentine! Meet the womb ripper. It's been forever and no one is coming for me. Maybe I can make a run for it. Uh, swoosh. Well, he's probably fine. He doesn't have a womb. What are you going to rip? The wiener. The wiener ripper. Okay, so I have a hammer. Can I use hammer? No. <laughs> All right, it would make sense. Empty locker, empty locker. Sure, empty filing cabinets. Or, yeah, nothing interesting. It's all useless shit. Computer can't help me. <sighs> What's back here? <gasps> Wet floor signs. I could place them all over and he would never be able to go anywhere near me. It's a receipt for a building repair company. Looks like they had to repair one of the walls in the laundromat with plaster. Surely I couldn't use a hammer or anything like that to break through it. something for this. Run for it. Alright, good talk. Priest is on, I guess. Run for it. Run for it, Marty! Aha, uh -huh, there's a door behind here. <clears throat> door to the old laundromat. It's so old. I wonder if one of these dryers works. 
My clothes are still fucking wet. Doom doom. Doom doom. Doom doom. Doom doom. I I I I don't know what that is. But I'm always very curious of weird little objects on the ground. Crate! Can't open it. It's firmly nailed shut. You have a hammer! <laughs> Newspaper. Eh. The headline reads... We're supposed to be scared. <laughs> I can't help it. Main suspect in police investigation disappears. 45-year-old Lewis Kenny has gone missing. The top suspect in the grisly crime of an arson and alleged kidnapping slash murder of a young woman has eluded authorities. Sources say that Kennedy has been under surveillance for a few weeks, and at some time over the course of last night had broken contact with officers. And it has not been seen since. Authorities issued a warning for all residents in the area to be on the lookout for a potentially dangerous individual. This potentially dangerous individual. It's empty, like my soul. Hammer time! Burr? Minecraft torches? Freezer! It won't open. Flashlight! I have too many things now. Oh, okay. So the flashlight's not even something I can... It's not even something I can use. It won't budge. Well, what a bastard. Uh, nothing useful, won't open, won't budge. Am I dumb? I think I might be dumb. Nope. Whoa! Uh... I better let him in. <laughs> what do you want from me? Hide. Get this? Oh. Ah! That makes sense. Painful? Nope. Okay, it's fine. Oh, hi! It's a corpse. It looks like it's been here for a very long time. Uh, nope. How long have I been here? Last thing I remember was walking home and now I'm locked inside this godforsaken room. Who would do this to me and why? I need to find a way to get out of here. There's dried blood on the walls and floor, and I have my child to think about now. Flesh. Oh my god. Bad. Ah! I have been sprayed. Another note. I know I won't be getting out of here alive. That psychopath, it, it kills women like me. I've heard at least three others brought here and killed. Peeking through the cracks, I saw that it creates these masks out of the skin. Skin from the poor infants whose mothers were just slaughtered. I don't know what kind of game it's wanting to play. I think my time is almost up. It made me swallow a key. A key I think would get me out of here, but I have a feeling it won't let me live long enough to use it. I'll be strung up and butchered like the rest. And my baby. Oh god, I'm sorry, my little angel. Yep, scalpel! Perfect. Well, she said she was strung up, so I assume it's you. Uh. I can't believe I'm doing this. Schwank. Oh, look, a key. Just a friendly little key. Do, 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 do. 
I have done it. I have escaped with the key. He'll never find me here. Oh my god. It's a corpse. <laughs> it looks like it's been here for years. There's a wallet sticking out of his pocket. What? Well, the driver's license belongs to Lewis Kennedy. Dun, dun, this dun. doesn't make any sense. I need to get out of here and call the police. Take the wallet with you. It probably has money or credit cards. Or both. Oh, you... you <laughs> pleasantly blump. This is terrible. She's been splayed up and... Looks like she hasn't been very long. Long enough. Dun dun. Dun dun. Dun dun. Dun dun long hallway. Dun. Find the child. Uh, water. I don't like babies. Uh, you can go through here. I saw you, you sneaky son of a bitch. I'm gonna get you and I'm gonna skull fuck you to death. Uh, perfect. I better keep this with me just in case. Trying a button to automatically equip the gun. Oh, okay. Do I have infinite ammo? I doubt it. Oh, good. They're all full of blood. Good little blood washing. Blood wash. Yeah, I guess I'll find it. Well, the cop died. <laughs> yeah. He must have. Okay. I guess this doesn't work on it. And this gun has no bullets! Fuck me! <laughs> You're just making things difficult on purpose. No. Huh? What was that? <laughs> that sounded like something. second first because this is kind of fucking sus <laughs> locked and loaded doll it's a doll that's been cut in half yeah looks that way suspicious more suspicious God, I hope I don't fall off this thing. I feel like a fucking idiot. Sound came from somewhere. Lock. Bang. No lock. Nope. Come out, you asshole. Yeah, you son of a bitch. You. I'm feeling very, uh, rewind or die right now. Like, I kind of just need to stand in a corner and wait on him or some shit. Damn it, JoJo, you and Mike have something in common. You put me in very awkward little spots that I can't see shit in. Around corners. Well. Correction. We're not ready for you. I was ready for any of this. Uh. Oh, I'll 
don't you shut up and die. Looks like this god awful noise is coming from a centralized point. Oh, we got him. Survivor! I'm a survivor! It all makes sense now. Lewis Kennedy wasn't killing all those women. It was Samantha. After Lewis locked her in the laundromat and burned it down, she survived. Sammy! She must have lost her baby, though. With almost being killed, losing her child, and being terribly burned, she completely snapped. Where's her boobs go? Lewis. And then set her sights on killing others who had something she didn't. They burn her boobs off and she grew pecs. Oh, God. Loading. Wait. <laughs> we did it. Damn it, Jordan. After credits. Oh, yeah. We have to wait on the credits to be done. Woo! Gonna, gonna sw swing swung us into high gear. I don't know. Thoughts? Love it. Absolutely love it. Uh. <laughs> We're. I mean, we're, we're, we're alone right now, so, uh, my divulge, I don't want to really divulge secrets of things that are to come, really, but, let's say that I'm, oh, I'm going to be doing something interesting very soon that has something to do with something we've done recently, and I may have something to do with something also coming up soon that has something to do with something we're doing tonight. <laughs> Northberry Grove will be a good game for you. That sounds familiar. I need to write that down. <laughs> Grab my writing utensils. Northberry Grove. Well, yeah, I, I love the story. Anything this fucking dark is great well, I was pretty upset to be woken oh. up so late for an impromptu autopsy <sighs> yeah I know that feeling but when they told me that it was the actual womb ripper well I got down here as soon as I could I can't believe that it turned out to be Samantha Rhodes who'd gone missing and was presumed dead years ago better check my note oh police report Cause of death. Multiple gunshot wounds. That's the official cause of death. But Jesus Christ. <laughs> I don't even understand how she was alive in the first place. Let alone how it took so many shots to bring her down. Yeah. Most of those looked fatal on first glimpse to me. Guess we'll dig in and find out more. Esk. He'd clean this out one day. Eh. Uh, wanna be nosy. My schedule. It's a shame my guests don't seem to respect it. 
Eh, part of the job. Eh, anatomy. Stuff and things. Okay, I don't think there's anything else I can do that's special. Begin autopsy. Mmm, sounds like steak. What the hell? The power went out. The fuse box is down the hall. I'll be right back. Don't you go anywhere. Tip toe by the window. I'm just walking through the halls of my mortuary. Hmm? Hmm? Walking through the halls of my mortuary. Covering up some bodies, doing an autopsy. <laughs> oh, Samantha, I'm back. Oh, Samantha, why do where the women in my life always leave me? What the? She's gone. I have to get out of here. <laughs> You're trapped. <laughs> There's only one way out. It's in the fridge. We keep miscellaneous body parts. What? <laughs> it's not over. It's not over till I say it's over. Ah. Damn. I hate that there was only an hour left of it. Uh, there we So, let me turn this down a bit. Turn it way down. Because I do have one more teeny tiny little thing to do. Oops. You do? It's... It's, it's nothing really special, special. It's, uh, just what I've been... Also, hi, YouTube. <laughs> I've been really terrible at getting, uh, everything put up in the YouTube archives as of late. Because for some odd reason, uh, Streamlabs and Twitch have been assholes in splitting my videos up. So, I've been having to re-download them and fuck with them, but I'm almost there. I'm just missing one, I think. Uh, let's see here. Let me get it pulled up. No. Okay, it's fine. Uh, let's see. Oops, that's that's me. <laughs> So, game capture is fine because it's not there. Screen capture. So, it's the last time we had to do this. I kind of do want to implement, for shits and giggles, the little community story, uh, horror story or script time at the end of streams. But... Ended up doing it a kind of an odd thing today, so we don't have as many people here. I didn't really advertise it that well either. Thought I was even going live. But, uh, anything you want to add into the, anything you want to be in the thing, like a person, place, thing, object, what the fuck ever, I'm literally just going to type in here, uh, write a scary story with <laughs> evil pickles you know what that kind of sounds like enough to me we'll try it what do you got <laughs> all right once upon a time in a small town there was a farmer named john john was known throughout the town for his delicious pickles which were said to be the best in the entire state however one day Something strange happened. John noticed that the pickles had been grow- Oh my god. 
John noticed that the pickles he had been growing in his garden were starting to look different. They had an evil, sinister look about them, and their green color was darker than ever before. John decided to harvest them anyway, thinking they were just a new breed of pickles. <laughs> but as soon as he took a bite of one, he knew something was terribly wrong. The taste was bitter and sour, but there was something else. It was as if the pickles were alive, and they wanted to do him harm. New breed, fuck yeah. I thought that would be good enough to be something interesting. The pickles began to multiply rapidly, taking over John's entire farm. They started to grow legs and arms, and their green skin turned into a dark, slimy texture. They were no longer just pickles, but evil, living creatures. The pickles started attacking everything in their path, including animals and humans. They moved quickly and silently, leaving a trail of destruction in their wake. People in the town were terrified, and many of them fled in fear. John tried to stop the pickles, but it was too late. They had taken over his farm, and he was powerless to stop them. The evil pickles had become an unstoppable force, and no one knew how to stop them. The people of the town were eventually forced to band together and come up with a plan to defeat the evil pickles. They tried everything from setting traps to burning them, but nothing seemed to work. It wasn't until a group of scientists from a nearby city arrived that they were able to find a solution. What is this, a goosebump story? <laughs> the scientists discovered that the evil pickles were the result of a chemical spill in John's garden. They were able to create an antidote that neutralized the chemicals and destroyed the pickles. In the end, John's farm was destroyed, and the town was left in ruins but the people were grateful to be alive, and they never forgot the terrifying experience of the evil pickles. To this day, no one in the town grows pickles, and they warn anyone who tries to grow them to be careful, lest they suffer the same fate as John. <laughs> Not the ads. Not the ads. Oh, oh, got one more. Go for it. Go for it. We'll start a new one. Because I'm keeping all of these, like, backlogged in case we actually... Because uh, I was playing around in the one that says Saw Situation Solved. I actually decided I wanted to see if it would actually change stuff. It's 30 seconds. Go for it. <laughs> oh, wait. Do you mean type in right up? What do you what are you wanting me to do? I'm confused. <laughs> Just type in write a horror story in thirty thirty seconds and hello. So I'll literally just type in thirty seconds and hello. Suspicious. Oh, you had ads. <laughs> oh, the ads. Thirty seconds. Oh, 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 oh. oh. <laughs> I was very fucking confused. <laughs> I thought you had just come back from the ads, and you were telling me to type in thirty seconds and hello as a story. But uh, let's see. We can do another one. Uh, let's see. I don't know if you guys suggestions go for it. That a horror story that ends badly. Wait, that doesn't have a positive oops positive ending there's six of 30 seconds let's try let's try this I don't know 
of Sherlock Holmes versus Wasps. <laughs> I broke it. As Sherlock Holmes walked through the dark and gloomy forest, he couldn't help but feel a sense of unease. It was unlike any case he had ever taken on before, and he knew that there was something sinister lurking in the shadows. As he walked, he heard the buzzing of wasps getting louder and louder. He tried to swat them away, but they just kept coming. He realized with horror that the wasps were multiplying, and they seemed to be targeting him specifically. Despite his best efforts, he was quickly overwhelmed by the swarm of wasps. They stung him repeatedly, and his <laughs> he felt his body growing weak and numb. He tried to call for help, but his voice was drowned out by the constant buzzing of the wasps. As he lay on the ground, helpless and in agony, he realized that this was the end. He had always thought he was invincible, but now he knew he was just as vulnerable as anyone else. In the end, there was no rescue, no miraculous cure. There was only the endless buzzing of the wasps as, as they continued to attack him until his body lay still and lifeless on the forest floor. And so the great detective Sherlock Holmes met his untimely end at the hands of the tiny but deadly wasps, a victim of his own hubris and overconfidence. God, oh, jeez. <laughs> that was pretty fucked. That was, that was pretty dark, I'm actually... <laughs> Sherlock Holmes, greatest detective of all time, killed by a gaggle of fucking wasps in the forest. That was pretty bleak. <laughs> I'll, I'll give you that. <laughs> That was fucking amazing though. It was. I, I really liked that. I'm gonna clip. I'm gonna cut that one out itself and put it on like fucking TikTok and the YouTube shorts and everything. It was great. I, that was fucking brilliant actually. So big preach for that one. You you nailed it. <laughs> God, I hate that it's not two hours, but it is like fucking ninety goddamn degrees in here, and I'm gonna die. Can we get more Sherlock? Sherlock Holmes versus horror stories. Fuck yeah, we can. You know, let's do one more. Let's do one more. We'll do one more and we'll, uh, we'll wrap it up and I'll get to editing all this shit and, uh, cutting things and posting them everywhere. This is great. No, oh, wait. No, no, no. I gotta start a new one. New chat. It should be like a series. Yeah. It kind of will be in a way. Uh, in like the shorts and stuff. YouTube shorts and whatnot. I may do stuff like this in, uh, in my spare time and just record probably maybe the audio. Because I've not put anything on my podcast in ages. Write a 30 second horror story about Sherlock Holmes versus what do you think? I'll leave it to you. This was this was your brainchild. <laughs> the Joker. Nice. Let's go. <clears throat> Sherlock Holmes had finally tracked down his arch nemesis. Fuck. <clears throat> My throat. <clears throat> Sherlock Holmes had finally tracked down his arch nemesis, the Joker, to an abandoned asylum in the outskirts of London. As he crept through the dilapidated building, Holmes heard a sinister laugh echoing through the halls. Suddenly, he was struck from behind and everything went black. When he awoke, he found himself trapped to a, strapped to a chair, with the Joker standing before him wielding a twisted grin and a pair of scissors. Let's play a game, Mr. Holmes, the Joker taunted. I'll ask you a question, and if you get it wrong, I'll snip off one of your fingers. And with that, the twisted game began. Oh, wait a minute, that's just the beginning. Continue the story. Sherlock's mind raced as he tried to answer the Joker's questions. With every wrong answer, he felt a sharp pain as the Joker cut off another finger. 
As the game continued, Sherlock's options became increasingly limited. He knew that he needed to escape before it was too late. With a sudden burst of energy, Sherlock managed to break free from his restraints and tackle the Joker to the ground. The two struggled for control, but Sherlock managed to grab the scissors and plunge them into the Joker's chest. As the Joker lay dying, he laughed maniacally and whispered, You may have won this game, Mr. Holmes, but the real game has just begun. And with that, he took his last breath. Sherlock knew that the Joker's words held a terrifying truth. He had defeated the Joker, but he had also unleashed a darkness that would haunt him for the rest of his days. <laughs> this is cool as fuck. Oh man, I love this shit. This is like the coolest fucking thing ever. Like, the games are absolutely fucking amazing. And I love the games. Absolutely do. But this, this, I'm glad I started doing this. This is, this has become a staple. This is something we're going to do a lot of. Like a fucking lot of. <laughs> oh man. I might actually extend the streams to where we can do like. Uh, dedicate like a full 30 minutes or something at least to this. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's cool as shit. So, I, I will edit these and post them everywhere I can Twitter. YouTube shorts, all that stuff, uh, TikTok, but we'll, like, actually want that book. Yeah, and the best thing is, any of these we want to revisit at any time, I can just click on it and do like I did here, and just put continue the story, and it'll keep going. <laughs> so, any of this shit could actually, well, with the exception of Wasps versus Sherlock, I feel like that one kind of ended. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, that's badass. But yeah, so I'll, I don't know what I'll be playing tomorrow, but I will be back tomorrow, somewhere between 10 and midnight. I, I'll have to post it to like Twitter and the Discord if I can remember. We got to continue this one. We do. We have to. <laughs> Shit's just begun. So, I mean, at this point, we could either tell it to continue the story or we could just say continue the story, but add in something else or someone else and it would... I do wonder if Sherlock, like, as this goes on, if it'll make him become, like, more twisted and depraved and, like, lose his sense of righteousness. Gotta add in Batman. Sherlock will fucking kill Batman or vice versa. <laughs> but yeah, we, we totally do that. Fuck yeah, that's awesome. So, yeah. So, <laughs> we'll, we'll end it here. This, I think this is a good note. So, uh, yeah, big preach for everyone for tuning in wherever you're watching YouTube. I don't want to say Facebook. I don't even fucking have Facebook. YouTube, Twitch, what the fuck ever. <laughs> and, uh, this is some cool shit. So we'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.